picking up back where we left off in G-Force. You know, for those of you who are wondering and who cares to even watch my videos, you're probably wondering how I go from horror games to playing this. <laughs> well, it was actually a request by a subscriber. I get out of here. Oh, actually, I didn't need you, Mooch. Well, I'm about to die. <laughs> I might as well just take a look, take the L. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> Can I go this way? Nope. Oh, wait. There's a disc on top of that. I need to go back and get that. Okay. So. Right, I want to take this guy out first. So yeah, it was a request from a subscriber who wanted me to play, and I hate keep leaving games incomplete, so we'll play it. And now this little series that I have going on with this particular game, I just talk about random stuff. <laughs> In the last video, I spoke about a little bit about myself, and uh, because some of you guys wanted to know more about me, so hey. Why not share? Oh, this was in here, okay. Okay, alrighty. So now I gotta plant this, but... But what I wanna talk about today in this video is um, some of the stuff I've been um, seeing, particularly about Mr. Beast and, and giveaways. Now, I wrote down my little points here that I wanted to touch bases on because like we're not getting the entire truth from from everything that's being said and this guy dog tag who's been doing these documentaries that's been blowing up on the internet it's so big I mean I don't like talking ill about people and their accomplishments and what they do but there are some practices that I feel that uh, I have an issue with. And okay, both transmitters planted. You should be all set, Chief. We'll get into Perfect that. Man. Now make your way back to the security door and just leave the rest to me. So starting off, PewDiePie had said something that I didn't quite agree with. If you guys want to win a brand new PS5, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel. I can't believe people are still doing fucking giveaways. Holy <laughs> shit, it's so annoying. Stop this. I'm so tired of it. 10 years of YouTube, people are still like buying subs. With so over the next seven days, I'm gonna be giving a thousand random people that subscribe a free Samsung Galaxy S24. How is this legal? I don't get it. All I'm you have to do, it's a credit channel. All you have to do to enter to win one of these phones is subscribe. It's a scam, holy. I literally spent over a million dollars on these phones and we literally found him one minute before Zach. I spent over a million dollars on these phones. All you have to do to enter is hit that subscribe button. Samsung, I just want you to love me. So yeah, that's what a call to action giveaway is. At best, they are a way to buy subscribe. So yeah, the guy dog tag, he's, um out there talking about all the bad things about Mr. Beast and sure I, he's not a perfect guy no one is I'm sure we can find dirt and dog tag too all right there's dirt out there on everybody dirt on me dirt on you dirt on every every everything and everybody out there there's something bad to talk about my issue comes up with well PewDiePie especially so so the controversy with, with Mr. Beast that's one thing but I'm not really, I don't really want to talk about that too much because the video speaks for itself. Only thing I'll say about that is I feel like with the challenges, they are challenges. They're supposed to be hard for a reason, right? Now, my issue comes with when you're, when you're done and you can't leave. I got off the treadmill. Oh, the blisters I had on my feet were like, you wouldn't believe. It's all over, just these big red... I couldn't, I couldn't walk. My, my, my muscles were like, just the lactic acid. I, I, 
so I'm in this situation where I, my, my mental health is not good. My physical health is getting worse, but we're filming. So I'm doing bits. It was too real. If they're faking videos, why couldn't we fake this one? But Jimmy had his like, he was sitting in the chair, turned around like an evil villain. Swear to God. That's my problem. I feel that no matter, you, you shouldn't put somebody's life potentially in danger for content. And if they're, if they say they're done, they're done. The no means no, the, the, the no means, what did they put in there? They said the no does not mean no. Never take no at face value. If we need a store to buy everything inside of, and you can call the local Dollar Tree, and the person that answers says, no, you can't film here, that literally doesn't mean sh it just It just means that you have to try harder for a yes, or that's not how it should be. They, they had something in there. I'll see if I can find that clip. If someone's done, they should be done, and they should be allowed to leave. Hey, the challenge is not until you say so. Uh, so that's pretty much my only issue with it. And then... Okay, Speckles, I'm at the access door. Hang on. There. It should be open. You are a genius. Heading in. Yeah. So that's one thing. Okay, we have... What do we have in here? Uh-oh. What is this? A flashlight? This flashlight looks big and bad. Oh, is this a boss fight? Alright. Let me focus on this real quick. We'll, we'll get back. Can't shoot it. Okay, what do I do? Piggy, tell me what I need to do. <laughs> it has home? I gotta destroy the dishes. Okay, how do I? Oh, it's on my tail. How do I do that? I don't get to it. I go up here. Attracting the missiles towards the satellite barriers. Oh. Here we go. Got him. Hopefully he has this some some life over here. Nothing's in the box. Okay. Let's go over this side. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay, I didn't start all the way over. Oh, come on, dude. Work with me, work with me. So, oh, it's open. Great. Take that, take that. All right, so, as I was saying. So, uh. Shields protecting the torch are down. Finish him off. Good. Good. Finally got rid of him. Ooh, got a gold coin. That's another upgrade. Oh, dang. Would have been a shame if that thing, like, took me out right at the, right after I defeated him. So, Mr. Beast has to allow people to leave when they want to leave. That's, that's one issue I have with them. Then the illegal lottery thing that they spoke about. I mean, 
that that could very well be a scam. I, I don't think they should. He should okay, allow. Darwin, just hack in, and I will upload the virus. Roger, Specs. This is it, Darwin. Bring her down. Wait a second. The system shows that it's still online. The virus didn't work. Aborting the mission. G Force. Everyone, exfil. Getting out now. Uh oh. Damn. Where are we going, little Early. man? Early! Come in, Early! Okay, okay. It's an ambush. Just looking for something to eat. Early! Get out of there! Okay, I'm leaving already. Guy, I uh, need some help. Like now? Somebody? Anybody? I'm so done for. Ah, oh, you better, you better do some. Oh, look at that! <laughs> Are we gonna use this little circle? Ah, shucks. Avoid crashing the RDB into obstacles by steering and jumping. All right. So, that's one issue. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Too much going on here. I don't know if this is actually. Whoa, I didn't see that coming. Serving fuel. Uh, Come on. Really? Come on, man. Hey, we gotta get get through this thing. Oh! I thought it was gonna blow up on me. Here we go. Uh. Press the jump button to switch to other tracks when let's traveling go. along the fixing. Let's go, let's go. Down. So So yeah, obviously, you know, Mr. B's gotta work on some things in the company. I feel that uh How am I not dead yet? I'm surprised. Press the jump button to switch to other tracks when traveling along the fixed pipes or rails. Supposed to go up. It's actually pretty long. I was expecting this sequence to be so long. That's one nasty roadblock ahead. Watch those shredders. Let's take him out. Bam! Okay. I think we're almost done. Then I can, then I can talk freely again. Oh. Oh. This. Them off. Okay, yeah. We better figure out what just happened back there. That's pretty neat. <laughs> All right. So we can turn the bad guys into uh, good guys. Where's the vent? Got one of these rumbus. I feel that. He shouldn't have such shady practices, you know, because apparently there are a lot of people that have has issues with him. So that's really all I got to say about Mr. Beast. When it comes to PewDiePie, which ties in, I was watching the, the documentary about the unsafe um, things that were going on in Mr. Beast that DogTag posted. And as much as I... I don't like talking about this stuff. I, I feel like I, I I like to say something about it, about the giveaways, right? Mr. Beast does a lot of giveaways. I I'm starting to do them like more frequently now, and I actually have another one coming up for the T-shirt. 
my issue is not so much the giveaways, but what you give away and how you give it away. And I, I don't think I ever want to get into like lotter lotteries, especially like the ones that Mr. Beast is doing. I think there are other ways that you can give back. And and with that being said, if his content is helping people, why is that such a bad thing? You know, I feel that if you're a YouTube creator, you a content creator about giving away challenges and things like that. Why does it matter if it's a, a camera's in your face? Right, if you agree to having a camera being filmed, why is that so bad? Why is that disingenuous if you're recording it? Why is that a bad thing if that's what you do to make money as a content creator? You've got to create content to make the money, to give it away, to make the money, to give it. It's a, it's a cycle. It's like you go to work to make money, but you're working for someone else. So I don't understand why the sh why the, he's getting all the shade behind that, and don't I don't get it because a lot of people would love to be in his financial situation. The most I would want to do when it comes to giveaways is what I'm doing now. I give away stuff on the internet, Charlie. <laughs> it's, Charlie uh, Moist Critical mentioned, uh, <laughs> I don't know if this thing will ever see the light of day from anyone, but I'm, I'm just going to keep posting. I, whatever, whoever actually watches this and gets into this video, leave your comments and your thoughts on it. Darwin, but that's a power core generator. The core generator powers devices all around the complex. You can attract and pull out the core using your electro whip. Carry the core using the electro whip. Throw or drop the core to stop carrying it. Oh, okay. This may require a little bit of concentration. Oh, the whip. I need the. Yeah, if the most critical said that uh, in one, he he got shade for like giving stuff away on the internet too. It's a giveaway. What I read today is about how the giveaways I do on stream where I just have viewers fill out a form, tell me how much money they want, what they're using it for, and then I go through randomly pure RNG and just pick people and then give them that money they requested is actually a sinister tax write-off. I am using it for a nefarious purpose. There's actually a lot going on behind the scenes that make this a really bad thing and me a bad person for doing it. Uh, I'll go ahead and play a clip from my most recent giveaway stream, and this is a thought that is prevalent quite a bit, because this is not the only person that has said this. Like I mentioned, today, there's been a couple of things I was tagged in that talk about this, and it just shocks me how even something as simple as just giving individuals money during streams is now a controversial issue. Hey Charlie, no tax write-off? I, I mean free money giveaway tonight? So it seems like there's people that think me giving away random amounts of money to random viewers on stream is a tax write-off. Do you not know how it works? Do you know how tax write-offs work? Because I can't write those off. I cut the clip short because I did get heated. That legitimately hurts me. Like, I'm not going to try and put up a front where I'm unbothered. I have thick skin, sure, but this actually hurts me. I just, I, I, rec I recognize how lucky I got in life, and I just want to do something nice with it. PewDiePie said, what PewDiePie said, I, I don't agree with. It's so annoying. Stop this. I don't agree with, because here's the way I see it, right? A giveaway is another form of engagement. If you're a small YouTube creator, this is one of the things I wrote down. So PewDiePie doesn't do giveaways, right? Do you not realize that the people who watches your stuff... They're the ones that allow you to live the lifestyle that you live. That's the bottom line. If it weren't, if you didn't have subscribers and you didn't have some, uh, people watching your stuff, you wouldn't have or live, be living the lifestyle you live. The subscribers are important. The, 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 the views are important. That's how you make your money. You make your money from... From, I need to figure out how to get this guy. Maybe I can just sneak around him. That's how you make your money. So, when they throw shade on Mr. Beast for all of that, and 
his his practices and all that. Hey, yeah, there's some unsafe practices, but he's a content creator. He has to create content. I'm a content creator. I'm trying to like, to be honest, I'm just trying to make a little bit of money so I can go back to Jamaica. I can go see my family. And I like YouTube to pay for it. But I also enjoy doing it too. So it's not something that, even if I don't blow up and I don't make a whole bunch of Mr. Beast money, I enjoy playing games. I've always enjoyed playing games. And, you know, hopefully one day I can t make a career out of it. But I shouldn't be demonized for giving away stuff. He shouldn't be demonized for giving away stuff. Uh, he, he shouldn't be... Yeah, there's some things, like I said, that needs to change. But it's engagement. It's an incentive for you to watch. Most people like giveaways and then mr uh, so i watch a lot of philip defranco as well and there's a clip he was talking about uh yeah all these people that have issues with him but there are a huge part a huge oh this comes back here yeah, that is doesn't help me in any way one of the star is the star at this thing oh the core what happened to the... Oh, I need to put the thing in here. Where did it go? Yeah, most people would love to be in Mr. Beast positions. I know I would. But I wouldn't be doing what he's doing. I don't want to... Like, it's like, I like people. I, I appreciate them watching. But I don't really have any hopes of, like... Being that big, honestly. I just... Like I said, I like to make this big enough to just make a career out of it. And, and quit my job. I'm happy with that. But as far as like, yeah, I'd like to give back to, to friends and family and all that too, but let's try this again. Because I think I may have <coughs> left this thing back over here. Giveaways uh, aren't a bad thing. They should never be a bad thing. I feel like people who watch your stuff and support you should be compensated in some way hence a giveaway is only one way yeah that's a lot of that's a lot of different ways you can give back to your your community i would like to get to the point where i'm giving away money like that too uh, because again you're nothing without your subscribers i watch all of them right and yeah they're so big now like your chances of winning anything are just so slim Oh, it is back here. Okay. 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 So I have to take this over here. Oh, shoot. I don't even have it on me. What? Wait. So, I mean, how do you feel about this? Like, what are your thoughts on giveaways? Do you think that they're a good thing, a bad thing? When you're small and you're trying to grow a YouTube channel, which is one of the things I wrote down here, if you're small and like me, I'm a small YouTuber, I like to grow. One way of growing is paying for uh, views and promotions and engagement. That's what you're doing. I mean, and it comes to anything where you're paying for on YouTube, it's a form of growing your channel, right? And one way of doing that is through engagement, right? You want people to watch your stuff, comment on your stuff, engage with your stuff. That's just the nature of the YouTube game. We're all in it for attention. We're trying to grow our channels and we can't do that without people watching our stuff now you blow up on YouTube right how do you how do you thank your subscribers I say I hear it all the time thank you I wouldn't be here without you you know this is the dream life I'm living and uh, but yet you don't do anything for your subscribers my kids sit and watch Unspeakable literally all day. They love Unspeakable. 
I have nothing against unspeakable. I'd like to get to his level one day where I can do stuff. But oh, there's another core here in here. Let's get up here. I got some cover now. I can probably take him out. Is he done? Yeah, he's done. There's, it sounds like there's another one. There's another one. What is this? Okay. He's out of the way. So, your thoughts on this. If you're any, the one person that watches this, Piggy, whoever, give me your thoughts. Leave your, your comments down below. I don't do videos like this often and I don't talk about the YouTube stuff that's going on out the bigger YouTube stuff but I realize that as I grow I know I'm gonna have to most likely deal with stuff like this as I get larger so I don't want it to go beyond this like if if it does and it probably will but uh, I'll deal with it then but the giveaways that I'm giving simple stuff right simple stuff and i don't know how i'm going to deal with it as i get larger but it's something that i will continue to do because i feel that i i would like to do more for the people who who is helping me grow that's just that's just how i feel about it even though so the engagement that you pay for when you're small Oh no, I have to, that's where I need to put it. So there's more. It's more than one. Okay. Let's go back up here. There's another one here. So do I have to move this thing around? Let me see. If, or if there's another, I think there might be, I think we might have to move this, this one around. Oh no. It's closed. It takes me back. Oh wait. There it is. It was right over here. All right, let's put this one here. Bam. Take them out. I'm thinking they're a little too much. Mr. Beast is so big, so large right now. He's he's not going anywhere. And you know what? With every success and every rise of somebody, they're going to find dirt on them to talk about, right? I'm sure two, three years from now, as he's doing his thing, and he will continue to do his thing because he is a content creator, this will blow over. Yeah, it may change some things, but yeah, challenges are supposed to be hard. But you, again, you should be allowed to quit when, when you're ready to go. So that's about... That's one of the things I would change. I can't, I can't go through the, I can't hang on to, oh, I guess I gotta go over here. All right, let's see. Oh. Uh, I don't feel that grown, uh, oh, so what I was gonna say, <laughs> again, I, I, I'm, I apologize for being all over the place with this, but when you're small, I'm small, I've paid for promotions on this channel before. Oh no, I dropped it. There we go, I got it. Good. That's what I needed to do.
Oh. This, this guy. Come here, come here. Yeah, I played for promotion before, and uh, what I realized is so, <laughs> and a lot of them are real shady too in their in their in their practices. So why not pay a genuine source that's already supporting you, your subscribers? If you get, I think I'm in a bit of trouble. My thought behind that is, oh wow, what is this? What is going on here? Oh, I can... Oh, no. Can I change him? Oh, no. That's not what I need. Oh, here we go. We can change him. We can change him. Good. Help a brother out. Where are you going? Where's he going? Can I shoot him like this? I wonder if I can. Hold on. Maybe I can. Oh no, that thing doesn't last me too long. There we go. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Paying for the uh, engagement on your channel. I use the promote. I've used Sprizzy. I've used a bunch of different play, um, promotional tools. Um, and there's still others. There's still some others that I'd like to, to try. But I noticed, especially with one of them, that if <laughs> uh, you miss a payment, you start losing subscribers. So... How is that any good? I'd much rather pay my subscribers and reward them for the engagement rather than paying a third party to do that. Paying a third party or even jam here. hold on. No exit from the storage area. Any ideas? Uh, uh, yes. I can see a vent leading from one of the storage rooms. Use Mooch for a quick recon and locate the exit. Mooch, my man. Stand by for your flying orders. Oh, we gotta go over here. Alright, come on, Mooch. Let's do this. Let's do this. So, yeah, I'm much rather pay for people who I know that subscribe on their own and not through a promotion I'm gonna try to give them something and tell them thank you for helping me grow my channel that's how that's my that's my thoughts on it Now, there are pros and cons to that, in my opinion, because if you're paying, you're, you won't grow as fast, right? The competition on YouTube, I know, is steep now, and everybody and their mama wants to be a YouTuber. That's just how it is. But from what I understand, YouTube, the growth on it is exponential. So you can grow super fast with a with a video that goes viral uh, so that's one aspect of it now if say say for instance hold on let me get this guy out of the way oh more of these guys So, so that's one aspect of it. You won't grow as fast, but at least you know that you your subscribers are genuine. And I'm much rather a genuine subscriber as opposed to a, 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 a maybe subscriber based on 
you know, your, your, your payment to a third party. Like, it, it's, it looks good for growing. It looks good for... Oh, I can't go up there. It looks good for... Uh, what, are, what am I? Oh, brand and, and sponsorships where your numbers are large. I think that's really what sponsors look at your, your influence and your reach. And that is based on your subscriber count. But I know a lot of my subscribers are inactive. 14K now. I may have maybe five or even 10. <laughs> Uh, core subscribers that that uh, engage with my stuff and comment on my stuff a lot of them were gained through promotions and nothing's wrong with that but I also realize that the promotions they they don't they don't engage with my content as much as I would like them to What do I need to do over here? Is there another vent over here? Oh, there is one. Okay. So again, on this, what are your thoughts on this? Should should small creators pay for engagement through a third-party software, third-party app, or should they pay the subscribers, the ones that um, that's been growing with them and 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 Grow them that way. Do I have to hit it when it turns green? When it turns green? Hold on. Let's see. There we go. Got two. Let's do this. Come on. Ooh, some big bad guys here now. Just stick a move, stick a move. Oh, come on, really? I'm out. Oh no, this shouldn't be here. Let me go, demon! So, small channels and, and their growth tactics versus large channel and their growth tactics. Is it really that different? 20 years from now, when I'm hopefully a much larger creator, what will I be like if I had 100 million subscribers? What will I be doing? What will my team be doing? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but one thing I do know, the giveaways won't stop. I want people to, to, to I would like to give back to the people who helped me grow. And I don't see that as a bad thing. I would like to do some challenge videos too, but nothing like, like Mr. B well, Mr. Beast kind of does them. In some of his videos, but the uh, some of the challenge videos, like like Wipeout, yeah, I like to do stuff like that. Maybe one day, but in due time, I suppose. I suppose that that could be a thing. It will be one day. 
but... YouTube is really a lot of work. <laughs> uh, putting these videos together and editing is really a lot of work. And unless you're doing it, you don't know for sure. Um, and it, that's, that's irregardless of what kind of content you have. It's a lot of work. And growing it. You know, you got to really, really treat, it, treat it like a job. I'm finding that out firsthand, but I'd much rather do this than go to work, work, like an actual work. Uh, I never wanted to work a job anyway, like, but I know I need it. I appreciate the job I have and thankful that I got it. I've said that many times before. But Thanks for that. Everything's all full. Yes. Let's keep this going. This is probably going to be my longest video yet <laughs> on this game. And if you're still watching at this point, you're really a fan. You're one of the few that uh, I would like to give back to. You know, I see some of these videos, some of the guys I watch. There's another guy I watch called Hollow. Really, really great content creator. I love his his content. He's one of the reasons why I got into horror games. I, I love watching some of his videos. Oh. Can't go here yet. I need to figure out a way to turn off these things. No. Something on one of these computers. I think I need to go over here. So, PewDiePie doesn't do giveaways. A lot of the large creators they don't do giveaways and here we go this is where I should be going hey sweets it's morning now, and baby girl just woke up. You okay, baby? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Yes, for sure. Just delightful. Markiplier is another great YouTuber that I watch, and uh, Corey, Corey X Kenshin, who's probably my favorite. All these people, big creators, big, big creators. Um, it would be it would be a dream to like be in their shoe one day, and I know it can be it can happen, and it is possible. Come on, fall! There we go. Ooh, where did he go? Whoa, that is a long way down. I didn't realize I was up so high. All right. How do we do this, sweets? Well, let's start over here. Oh, they're shooting at me too? Let's get this box out of the way. And uh, <laughs> mosey on all the way over here. I, I press the A button and I jump up and fly. Oh, there's a little another course park here. Oh my gosh. 
I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Let's see. Oh, there's another one of those flying things in the jiggies. Come on, get, get it. I can take this off if you like to hear. This one isn't bad, actually. Uh, 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 uh. Oh no, I'm out! I'm out! Again. I never want to see a vacuum again. That's a vacuum. Okay, that's what it was. All right, all right, all right. We need to take this and put it over here. Good. Relate. Reverse the flow. It's in there, crooked. Okay. Now we can. Uh, Jump on this. You okay? What's wrong? All these big YouTubers. I I sometimes wonder why they don't they all why they don't all give do giveaways. I feel like it's a great way of growing your channel. It's a great way to get some engagement. Oh another one. Another one. <sighs> yep, go down. All right. Oh, whoa. Where do you come from? Hiding in the box. You saw that, sweets? Yeah. Evil pancake waffle maker. Oh, what did that do? Great job. We're doing great. But yeah, I wonder why the larger creators don't give away stuff. Like, uh... Or just, just something to show their appreciation. Other than a thank you. I think a thank you is, uh... I don't want to say a slap in the face, but that's the only thing that's coming to mind. Because you can do more than a thank you. You can give a prize. You can do so much more than just okay, so thank you. Have arrived at the main storage depot. Good. The uh, security feeds show offices just ahead. I can also see that the elevator is not working. Go see if you can get it up and running again. Thanks for the heads up, Speckles. Thanks for the heads up, Speckles. Ooh, a vending machine? Oh, a soda cooler. Everything flies in here. Oh, no, he's got a shield. Oh, what is this? Is this gas? Oh, no, I can't go down there. So, which is why I would like to... Continue my giveaways. Not something that I would stop doing because I'm nothing without my subscribers. That's that's the same for every YouTuber, large and small, trying to grow a channel. You take care of your subscribers, they'll take care of you. And although you don't really need subs to, yeah, the subs is not really what makes the money. It's the views. I know that. But if you have a loyal sub base and they'll bring you the views, you know, so yeah, I don't know. I'm just ranting at this point. There are many different ways of growing your channel and the giveaway is just one way. Get up here, no. Let's get up here. We gotta get rid of this this thing. But it's uh it's got a force feel on it. Oh, he's throwing soda cans at me. Let's 
get out of here. Let's get out of here, sweets. Where's the, um... I need to get something. Oh. Oh, wait. Maybe I can use him. Yeah, I'm gonna transform him to work for me. Oh, you can't do anything back here anyway. Oh. Never mind. You're worthless. You're worthless, you useless thingamajiggy. Alright, you know what? I may have to use the fly. I may have to use leech. But I need to find a secure location. For, oh, here is the thing. This is what I need, gnomes. This is what I. Uh oh, what is this? The air freshener. Work for me. It changes them to work for me. Oh no. Okay. How long do I die before can I go in here? I can't go in the green. No, I get training for this kind of problem. All right, here we go. Bam! What did that do? Nothing yet. I need another one. Power core active. Alright, we need to activate the other one. You wanna see the fly? Alright, let me get over here. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh. Let's hide back here. Like get Mooch. Here we go. Let's go, Mooch. Pew, 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 I wonder if I can disarm his, uh, can't do anything with him. Oh no. The shield is still there. I can't get rid of the shield. Ooh, there's another life here. Oh, the core is all the way over here. Okay, so. I wonder if I could take it up with him. Oh, I can carry it. Look at that! I didn't know I could do that! <laughs> oh no! Oh, the thing got me! The air freshener got me! That jerk. That's right over here. That's right here. Yeah, I do. It's a shame I can't, like, just go over this thing. This is weird. Oh, hold on. Let's see. I'll drop this here. I'll go up here. And then I'll go down here. Now I'll get my fly. I'm going to go in this corner. Get moochy mooch. And I'm going to go all the way. Oh, no! Oh, there's a, there's a fan right here. Oh, I see. Okay. Ah, oh, they really made this challenging, huh? Yeah. Me too, no. No, let's see if I can do it again. Oh, I can't do it. I'm too close to this thing. How about if I go over here? That's better. Oh! Can 
I turn it off? Can't do any of that. All right. That's no bueno. No bueno. So. We got to just go down there and get it. Speaking of it, where did it go? I was back over here. Okay. Here we go. Got it. That's how you do it, sweets. Bam! The elevator powered up. Got my door powered up. Where do we go now? So, I'm just a regular YouTuber trying to uh, make it on the platform. No different from any other YouTuber. I, I, I realize that I haven't been experimenting as much as I would... I should with my content Just as I'm still small one thing I can say is that it, it for anybody who's trying to grow a YouTube channel pick one genre and stick with it at least at least until you you build up a following I changed like four or five times on this channel this channel alone and it kind of Stunted my growth for a long time, and I know that because of this. A lot of the challenge, the videos that other channels that my subscriber watches, that has been updated so many times. It takes a long time. All right, Juarez. I'm at the production computer, and you should be getting the factory plans oh, now. Coming through fine. Just stand by for another oh, yeah. minute. Looking at this. Hold on, let's see. Best deal with the immediate threat first. Stop the shipping of the appliances, then their production. And after that, make sure that no more microchips get made. Sounds good, Darwin. The fire extinguisher is gonna eat us. It's gonna blow us up. Oh, come on. A fire extinguisher that blows fire. <laughs> You're supposed to extinguish fires. Oh, got another gold disc. I'm going to leave this one there. Um, and if you made it anywhere in this video, leave some thoughts on your comments. I, I know I have... Um, Alone in the Dark to play, and that's coming up next, actually. But I feel like it's just all noise and all drama. And I, yeah, I don't know what more to say about it. But Mr. Beast is not an evil guy. Mr. Beast is not an evil guy. None. Of, I, I feel like we're all on the platform to to make a living, to make some money, to support our families. And yeah, there's some things that could change. But, from creator to creator, um, it's all for engagement. It's all for content. All right. So until next time, I'll see y'all in another rant video. <laughs> all right. Take care. Peace. Let me go take care of this girl.